What's up, yo? South African Geek here. Welcome to my channel. Jonathan Major. It devoted. It's Kang the Conqueror himself. He's also in Creed 3. Dude is working, working. He's taking so many different jobs. He's showing his acting chops to the max. This has to be a war movie. Because of the thumbnail. <laughs> or otherwise, it'd be weird. It's essentially not weird timing for it to drop next to Top Gun Maverick. Anyway, let's dive right into this trailer. Ooh. Okay, I didn't expect it to be that much of a war movie. God damn. You ain't never land in that plane. Who is he talking to himself? Ooh, they shot stuff. Ooh. The Navy. You ain't shit. Yo. Flying through this. Isn't he top gun also? I think he's, he is in top gun. That Joe Jonas? <laughs> of course, this is a true story. You're flying with. See what they're fighting for. He's fighting for his family. Hoping to find that out. Try to keep up! Yo. This is war. Ooh. And we're up. Looks like we're gonna get glimpses of the war, but most of it is gonna be a war of the skies. Cause I feel like they keep using the same kind of shots from the ground. You can't always do what you're told. Ooh. Devotion to country. Only a theaters, right? October. Hmm. They really started to press for a lot of August, October type of series movies right now. It looks great. Like I said, I saw some reused footage a couple of times, like the ground footage. Because it makes sense because this is about a, a Navy pilot, so, or Navy pilots. It's got, look, looks like got two co leads. Um, I swear I saw Nick Jonas, I mean Joe Jonas in this shit and the last war movie I watched was Pearl Harbor and it had Nick Jonas what's with the Jonas Brothers and picking like war movies <laughs> I'm just saying anyway like and subscribe I'm definitely gonna check this out deuces